Hey, what's going on everybody? It's your boy James and today I got an unboxing for you. We're going to be unboxing the Barbecue Mods uh, two-tier grate for the Oklahoma Joe. It's something I've been waiting on for quite some time so I'm really excited to go ahead and get this on the pit. We're going to show you guys what it's like for packaging. We're going to open it. We're going to install it and just give you my first impressions on how I like it. All right, let's go. So as you see, it's packaged up very well. Got some uh, extra boxes here. Let's see what this is. I don't think this is anything. It feels kind of light. Yeah, it's just empty. So we got the brackets. You can really see the welds here. I like it a lot. Not too bad. We'll put this to the side. Now what I did notice is there is no instructions included. So that's fine. I mean, it's not rocket science. The wells on this look amazing. I'm very impressed. Yeah. So overall initials, this looks really good. It's very simple. These two are sliding in the respective right and left side of the pit. I'm assuming this is the bottom as it's bigger and this will be our top one. And we'll be able to move this in and out. So let's go ahead and hit the pit, install this and see how it looks compared to the old one. All right, so the first thing that we're going to do is just go ahead and remove the old grates. We're not going to throw these out, just going to hold them down. Then we're going to take these legs. So the cool thing is that these actually fit really well right on the grips and I'll get in here and show you guys a little bit better So what we'll do now is go ahead and add in the large grate. Very nice. Just a little bit of finagling to get it nice and flat. But this is perfect. Next. Now we got the top rack. So I can definitely see that there's going to be a lot more useful space here. Definitely have enough room clearance on top. And we definitely got plenty of space on the bottom.
Let's go ahead and set the fit, see what it's like. That looks really good. Yeah. Nice. So what I'm going to do now is more of a personal thing. I'm going to go ahead and rub this down with some oil, light a fire, let the smoke hit it, and we're just going to go ahead and clean it out. So one thing I do during my seasoning process, take some canola oil right here, just dab my paper towel with it, and we're just also going to rub right outside of the pit as well. And this really helps keep it oiled, keeps it looking good. I try to do this a couple of times, just get all around it, keep that nice black look as much as possible. Couple of sticks of hickory. We'll let that catch. And the whole goal is just to let it just flow in and kind of just season and create some nice smell into the pit. So I thank you guys for watching. It's a pleasure. If you got any questions, let me know. I'll give you guys any updates if I find any type of changes on the pit. But so far, so good. All right, guys.